Yo, yo, I'm Chillax, and I have no one to promote. <laughs> Unfortunately, I couldn't find Stephanie's attire from WrestleMania 40 on Community Creations, so I'm going to be doing something a little different. I take no credit. I'm not uploading this to the CC. I will show you. I think I got pretty close to what Stephanie wore at WrestleMania. Here is the top that I used. I found it in the third column right above the Big Daddy top and then I used the matte material and made the color completely black. Here's the pants that I used. I found them under the generic tab in the fourth column. Just scroll down a few times and you should be able to find them. Same thing as before, I used a matte material and made the color black. Last but not least, these are the shoes that I put on her and I also made them the color black with matte material and I would say that's pretty accurate other than her hair I wish console players could change hairstyles maybe find a version with her hair down on community creations and then copy this attire if you can find one good luck shout out to crooked alloy on YouTube for creating this custom Stephanie McMahon Titan Tron he personally sent me this Titan Tron but I put a link to his channel in the description definitely go check him out show some love and stay tuned as we continue to bring you the most up-to-date entrances on WWE 2k24 and Beyond. To get the images, search Steph WM40 Tron, and if that doesn't work, try Stephanie McMahon or Yo Chillax. I posted 10 images on CC with the white square highlighting image number one. These images are in order from right to left. You obviously don't have to download all images, but keep in mind the following tutorial showcases all images. So now that we're in video, you want to click image animation, custom images, and all images it should be at the bottom of the list in the correct order. For the first image, you're going to find the animation that doesn't make any animation. Move the image to the left until it stops, and if the image moves off the canvas, then I suggest cutting out a white piece of paper. Take the straight edge side of the paper to the middle of the canvas, and just do the best you can to line up the images. If you don't have any issues, go ahead and press the right directional button on your controller 38 times. And then I set the length to 40 milliseconds and place the image on the middle layer. The second image is about the same process. I find the animation that doesn't make any animation. Move the image to the right until it stops. Stretch it evenly and press the right directional button on your controller 38 times. I placed the second image on the top layer and then placed the rest of the images at 40 milliseconds. If you have any questions, just let me know in the comments. Moving on to the entrance formula, I didn't really change anything other than the Titantron is our custom one and the nameplate was supposed to appear right before she entered the ring, but it didn't work. Thank you all for watching. If you stayed and listened to me until this point, you will know that my next video is a surprise. So I hope you all stay tuned, stay cool, and stay chillaxed. Peace.